Hey, what's going on guys? Brian here. Hope everybody is doing well. A little video for you guys today talking about closing ratios and pricing and what we're seeing out there in the marketplace and want to just have a conversation with you guys and see if you are experiencing the same thing that we're experiencing. Uh, really quick, this conversation stemmed from our private Facebook community called Link. Little pitch here, invite you guys to join Link. It's a community where you guys can grow with other folks in the industry. It's for guys that are in the middle, maybe 50 grand to a million. Folks that are looking to grow together, have a safe place to ask questions, so on and so forth, and build community. It's awesome. That being said, one of the questions that came up today, and we're talking about five to 10 posts a day. It's a really active group and a great group of folks in there. And uh, this was the conversation I wanna to present to you guys. It said, uh, one of the gentlemen in there uh, said, I've been getting my butt um, handed to me with my closing ratio ever switching to LMN. I feel like I haven't even given my company uh, a raise or my guys a raise or anything like that. Our leads are dwindling faster than I can replenish them. Anybody having those same issues? That caught my attention because I'm always trying to help people and trying to pour value in the folks, right? So somebody else said, I'm seeing the same thing with my closing ratio this uh, spring. We didn't even raise prices and uh, we're getting less closing. Another gentleman said, it's not you, it's the COVID warriors that messed up the market bad. And actually I said the same thing. Somebody said, I'm nervous about switching to LMN because I'm gonna know my numbers even more and that makes me more nervous. <laughs> That's funny. If you guys wanna switch to LMN, use code Brian. Uh, it saves you a gob. I wrote, this is such a good conversation. We we're closing less work as well, like so-and-so said, but the work we're closing at least we're making money on. At least we know we're making money on. And I said, LMN has been a huge eye opener. I can only uh, imagine how much work has been bid unprofitably over the last two to three years from all the people that have rushed into the industry. And so here's the quick conversation I want to have with you guys. Just ask a little pulse in the industry. Are you guys seeing less work close in general? Or have you seen less work close because we're raising rates? Have you seen folks, what I've noticed is I've seen folks reduce uh, service. Same budget, maybe budget's a little increased, but our services are more so they're reducing the amount of work that they're getting with that budget because very few people want to raise the budget or increase uh rates right for uh you know the hoas that we're bidding on or the commercial sites that we're bidding on like uh you know let's just not do mulch this year or hey can we get uh by without doing two uh cut cutbacks or prunings we'll just do one and it's really a, uh, again, I guess another sign of the times of the economic situation. In 2020, 21, 22, maybe even the very beginning of 23, people were just like, yeah, go ahead and knock out work, name your price. Um, I, I have buddies right now that are frustrated. They're thinking about getting out of the industry because they're not getting the same amount of yeses that they were in 2020, 21, and 22, right? They was name your price for us. And, uh, you know, they had a backlog of people calling and you couldn't pick up the phone fast enough. Fast forward two, three years later, and it's just funny how quickly the economy can change. And you know, now you're trying to sell work. Now you're trying to, uh, you're kind of sitting on, you know, pins and needles. Hey, the we were one of three bids. Hopefully, we get it. Versus three years ago, nobody had capacity to take on work, and you threw out a ridiculous number, got a great price on it, and um, you know, it's just different. It's just different times right now, right? Now you're uh, selling to get work versus work just coming on in. And, I've talked about this, many people have talked about this, uh, but it's just a little omen for some of you guys that maybe are younger or younger in business to realize like work is not just always going to be hand over fist in a roaring economy in 2021, 20, 22, beginning of 23, right? And that's just a sign of the economic situation we're in. I mean, the, the amount of things I've seen lately on Facebook, I'm spending more time on Facebook than ever because of our Facebook group. Um, but you know, of course you see the feed and all that mess and it's like today's middle class uh, versus 20 years ago's middle class. Like costs are up 80%, wages are only up like five or 10%. 175 grand is the new uh, average income that needs to be where the middle class lifestyle was back 20 years ago at 40 grand a year, right? all these numbers all these stats and uh, look i'm not an economist i'm not a very detail head anymore but all i know and all i can see is that people are getting squeezed people are getting squeezed i'm feeling it you know uh raising rates raising uh wages i should say with my guys i want to pay them more uh we've always kept up with inflation and then some with my guys pay like i i want to make sure that they're not feeling the the crunch but i have to charge that to the customers right and we have closed less work but similarly, I will just say this, now switching to LMN, we know our numbers and the work we are closing and the stuff that I'm at least bidding, I know I'm bidding it at a profitable rate. It's not a pitch for LMN, 
it's a pitch for you guys out there that are just making stuff up and still guessing and i was there for a very long time uh please don't do that it doesn't mean you need to switch over to lmn uh, it just means please actually put pen to paper do some math know what your company needs to charge to be profitable and then execute uh on those next couple contracts and bids right uh i, I feel like and uh, here's the last thing i'll just say tell me if i'm wrong but i've been on facebook a lot more than ever like literally i never go on facebook until four months ago when we created link the amount of times i went into facebook marketplace and the amount of equipment that i'm seeing out there that folks are selling off is i, I would honestly say alarming i see boss 92 stainless and steel dxt plows going for 4500 bucks those things are 10 11 grand brand new and those only have a year or two on them i see brand new boss vbx uh, salt spreaders that were you know six seven eight nine grand i i really don't know but they're selling them all day for three four grand on facebook marketplace um i've seen more uh, lawnmowers for sale hand tools for sale pressure washers for sale than than i've ever seen before uh dump trailers being for sale so prices are going up we're closing less work more guys are getting out because they're broke or they're going out of business which you know my heart goes out for that but it also is also probably a good sign that so many folks have tanked <clears throat> the market in terms of providing cheap work and they didn't know their numbers and now all these younger guys or it doesn't matter age wise right but younger and business guys they're getting out of work because now they have to sell or now they have to raise prices or actually run a real business as they continue to grow or expand right when it was just me i could charge 25 dollars a cut when it was me adding a guy and i have workers comp another truck insurance um labor all this stuff now i'm like whoa i've got to instantly charge 35 dollars a lawn well i should have been at 45 dollars from the very beginning because i have shop space rent space extra insurance policies more trucks more trailers more mowers and it's just akin to the the conversation that troy clog was like man i was getting you know 25 bucks back in the 80s he goes how are you guys still getting 25 bucks in 2023 2022 and now here 2024 right so um i don't know what's going on out there i just wanted to share a quick uh minute video with you guys have you seen the same thing are you closing less work than ever but the work that you are closing is highly profitable leave me some comments down below let me know what you guys are seeing out there all right guys we're well, gonna cut the video right there my cough is coming back unfortunately perfect timing when you do a video right all right over now guys have a beautiful day good luck with your quotes and bids and we will catch up with you guys here soon